Hey guys, today we're making this delicious strawberry ice cream. This recipe is super delicious and it's so amazing and so easy to make. This recipe requires an ice cream maker, so if you have one, then let's make some. Let's get started. Okay, so we're going to start off by adding your cold, fresh cream into a bowl. Now make sure it's nice and cold for this so it will whip up well. Once that's in your bowl, you can take your electric mixer and start beating this until it reaches stiff peaks. Now do make sure you don't overbeat this as it can separate. And of course, if you have a stand mixer, it would make it much easier. Once it's thick like this and reaches stiff peaks, you can stop beating and then you can add in your condensed milk. Then you're going to beat this all together until it's nice and well combined. Once that's done, you can start mixing and then you can add in any fruit of your choice. Here I'm just using some chopped up strawberries. And of course you can just, you can add in whatever you like. You can add in some fresh mango or make it coconut or even chocolate. And for the chocolate, you can just use some cocoa powder. And then you're going to just fold this in together. If you like, you can add in some color and then just fold it in. Next, you're going to take your ice cream maker and take the bowl that you put in the freezer and make sure it's nice and cold and then just set up your ice cream maker. Then you can pour in your lovely cream mixture into your ice cream maker. Now all of my cream did not fit into this. But of course you can make it in two batches. But make sure you freeze the bowl again if you want to make it a second time. Then you're going to just switch it on. And then let it churn for around 40 minutes or follow the instructions of your ice cream maker. It will become nice and thick and cold. Here you can see it gets nice and thick after around 40 minutes of churning. Once it's done, you can switch off your ice cream maker and then just take off the lid. Then you're going to take your freezable dish. I'm using a Pyrex over here, but you can use anything that you like. And just scoop all of your cream, of all of your ice cream into this. And then freeze for around 4 to 6 hours. And once it's done, you can scoop it and then serve. Enjoy! 
This ice cream is so delicious and it's so amazing. So easy to make and just the perfect recipe. It's so refreshing for the summer and you'll definitely love it. Thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a giant thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I post new videos every Sunday. I'll see you in my next video.